Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a little bit of a testing, uh, a taste testing actually. So I'm going to be testing this product. This is absinthe and this is actually 70% alcohol. The myth about it is that you hallucinate and stuff but that is definitely not true. It is an alcohol like any other alcohol. It's just very potent in alcohol so yeah so the thing is that I'm gonna be using this glass one part absinthe you have to use five parts water gonna put like this and then we need a sugar cube it actually smells so good because it smells of licorice and I love licorice like black licorice is just like the best it is actually um, something that is very eaten here in Denmark black licorice okay so the thing is I have to pour this over the sugar cube. I am just gonna be pouring um, the water into this container first. This container, I mean this bottle, obviously. Um, yeah, this is gonna be interesting. Okay, so the water is now in this bottle and um, the thing is that you have to drip it, you just have to drip it on the sugar cube to dissolve it. So Okay, while I'm pouring this, um, I'm gonna tell you a little bit about absinthe. So, absinthe is a alcoholic drink that is from 45 to 75 percentage of alcohol. Um, so it varies like a lot. It originally came from Switzerland and it gained its popularity back in Paris in the 18 to 1900s. Um, where a lot of people drank it like as a refreshing beverage. Um, after a little while, people started to think that you you could hallucinate from drinking it, and it got banned in many countries, as the United States and many countries in Europe, also France and Switzerland. Um, in the 1990s, it gained its fame back and um, it rose to popularity again and it is now very popular in Czech Republic, in France, um, also Australia I've heard and um, some other countries in Europe actually. And um, yeah, it's still gaining popularity a little bit. I'm gonna give this a little swirl. It really makes it around. I am not at all an expert at this, but um, this is my first time trying it. So, it's gonna be interesting. So, here's the big test. definitely not as strong as I thought that it would be but also it is only one part one to five one to one to four one to five around that um, mixed in with water and it still has a strong flavor like the flavoring is really strong but the alcohol it's not really that strong, it's not burning, like some people would take shots of absinthe, I've done that before, and that really burns a lot, like going down is like, whoa, that is not what you want at all. This is, I would say that, I had ice in my water, but it was not cold enough, I had it let, I sit it for too long, if what, like you really want really cold water, like this is, um, I think that it would be so much refreshing to have 
like really cold icy water and I thought that mine would be icy enough but apparently not my room is quite hot at this moment and um, all in all I'm satisfied but it's my own fault that it's not cold enough um, I don't think that this is a drink that I would have very often um, because it is absinthe <laughs> but I'm definitely um, more open towards it now like I don't think it's as bad as I thought that it would be I thought that it would be horrible but it's definitely it's worth giving a try definitely so if you like um, my video please like subscribe and comment down below if you want to taste absinthe